welcome back to sulo's classroom today we are going to get an idea about correct scissor graphs for that you will need a scissor soft play clay papers and some plastic straws suppose your child when they are using the scissor when you take the scissor you have to put your thumb finger into a hole then the middle finger you have to put your middle finger into other hole here thumb finger and the middle finger pointer finger ring finger and the baby finger you have to use to tap the scissor you have to keep the scissor in the middle of your thumb finger and if your child is left handed consider getting them left handed scissors use the same method for the left handed kids let your child practice when they learn how to use the scissor very first you have to give them soft things to cut last week we learned soft and hard things from that you have to give soft things to cut clay balls and plastic straws are examples for soft things so very first you have to give them to cut soft things don't give them to cut hard things and give them to cut alone finally gives to cut papers but you have to draw some lines some shapes first you have to give them to cut straight lines after that you can give them curves uh, shapes like those things when you use the scissor you have to keep your thumb finger on the top and when you use the help of hand you have to keep the thumb finger on the top of your helper hand like this way and also ask them to change the sides and cut When you use the scissor you have to keep your elbows and arms near to your body don't keep your elbows and arms from out of your body here like this so you have to keep your elbows and arms close to your body this is the correct way give them so many activities then they will learn more and more when you use the scissor you have to keep your thumb fingers on the top 
and you have to keep your arms and elbows close to your body don't keep your arms and elbows close out from your body these are some examples for the different kinds of scissors When you use the scissors, sit down to your cutting. And when you pass the scissor, you have to give the handle first to your friends. Always walk when carrying scissor like this way. And these are some tips from our lesson today. Hope you learn something about correct scissor graphs please like share and subscribe my channel i will be back soon have a nice day